Give me all the stuff, give me all the stuff, give me all the stuff. <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brendan Dayton. I'm your humble narrator. And welcome to The Wild Eight. A uh, survival game about a plane crash in the Alaskan wilderness. You get eaten by wolves. I'm fond of games like that. Initially, you'll uh, work pretty hard to set up a workshop as well as a... Uh, a main little camp and you can research some some cool stuff equipment to wear wicker outfits wicker boots oh I broke my boots I guess I'll make some more so we'll go to the crafting menu go to clothes wicker shoes craft them up and uh, they do increase your movement speed which I think is pretty nice however they get worn out from walking which is not great uh, I'll fold my workshop back up I think we're just about done here. I'm looking for a plane crash. I started way, way, way over here, and it said go to the east. So I went to the east, albeit a bit northwardly as well, so I think I missed the plane crash. Uh, so I'm gonna head back north and west, and we'll see what we can find. I have uh, bone claws, which are basically the best weapon that you can get. You have to research in order to get bone. Um, which is like a third currency in addition to the stone and the wood that you will be collecting to make basically everything else. Rabbit traps um, is pretty good if you don't want to risk your health fighting a boar or something like that, which happens quite often. <laughs> uh, here are some medicinal plants. You can make a healing salve, which is sort of useful, but I don't take advantage of it basically because um, food recovers your health, so it's there's not much of a point to it. Uh, I probably do want to collect... Oh, God. There's the wolf. Get the bone claws. You ready, boy? Get some of this. Oh, you gotta run. Now you're gonna run, huh? You fucking punk. Oh! All right, now I've got some meat. Gonna need to go ahead and eat real quick. We'll set up another campfire. Unfortunately, you can't pick up the campfires, which uh, is a bit troubling. We'll get some meat. Meat. More meat. More bone. Okay. So we'll cook this up. Get some mushrooms as well. Basically, I'll be eating to recover health. And yes, it is nighttime, so my health would drop exceedingly quick if I were to go out. Uh, here. Do that. Wonderful. We can have a nice little snacky. I guess I should harvest some trees while we're waiting. Because you always need wood. It is a consistent thing, especially because you're going to be placing many, many campfires. So you got some uh, bars there below my face. There's the health on the top, the stamina below that, and then finally, uh, food and cold, which is the things that you're probably going to be watching the most. So I'll pick up some fried mushrooms. Mm-hmm. Them's going to be good. Save me some meat. Really, I should be collecting these bones and whatnot, but it's really hard um, to do this correctly. Where am I on this map here? Alright, I need to head basically directly west. Oh, fuck! No, 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 no. The wolves, man. Out come the wolves! Ugh! Ugh! Fucking sucker! Initially, these guys were definitely kicking my ass, um, but now that I've got my bone claws, I got claws of my own! Oh! How you like it? How you like me now? I will take this meat with me. I'm sure we'll need it at some point. And, uh, I could make some more bone claws as well. Okay, fine. So to set out your shelter, select it and press F. Oops, I just ate some raw meat. <laughs> Why always the raw meat, Dayton? Um, get this bone. Get this bone. There we go. It's very precise. Must be very precise. Oh, now we got a couple of bones. Should I make some more claws? Is that a thing? Throw it! Huh! Okay. So now we can pick up our, uh, our shelters again. This is the research tree, thusly. Um, not extremely in-depth, but I do hope that it will become more so as uh, the game is developed. So, 
We'll pick up the workshop, pick up the shelter. Oh my god. We're already cold again. Like this shit. I guess I'll cook the, the other meat that I have. <laughs> Whoopsie do. I need to figure out how to make an axe or some such, but I do not think that it is in the demo version currently. Which is a little disappointing to me. We basically camped out here all day. Um, not exactly what I had planned for, but whatever. I'm gonna need some more some more stone kind of shortly as well. Durability, wearing through on those shoes as per usual. Dang, the harsh wilderness. I tell you what. Oh, there's some meat. I need meat. Could I make more bone claws? Is that a thing? Uh, crafting. Then we go to weapons. Sharpen bone. Sharpen bone. Oh, we're full. We're full on the inventories. What the fuck? What the fuck? Alright, put out this workshop, I suppose. I've got more work to do. Uh, more sharpened bone. I think you made the bone claws. Bone claws! You are my best friend! I don't worry about breaking, because you are bone claws. Okay, grab this. A little more fire. You should set out relatively soon. Which is what I said yesterday. Mm, ooh. I don't know if I should scavenge all of the, the blank spots there. I suppose I should. It would be the wise thing to do. Oh, it's some wood. I found some wood. There's some bones. Don't worry, I ain't gonna kill you. Not today. Watch out for the wolf. I really do like the design of the wolf. The aesthetic of this game is pretty cool. Pretty low res, but it's got a nice art style to it. Many deers over here. Hmm. Check the map, check the map. I hope it's not in this fucking blank spot. Is that directly east? Not really. Directly east is more down this way again. The map seems really, really gigantic. I'm not sure if it's actually uh, the size that it seems. I think I've been through this valley before, maybe. Oh, there's a boar. Please leave me alone. I have no core with you! <laughs> oh, man. Maybe I should take my bone claws off if I'm not, like, directly fighting something so I don't just break them on a tree or some shit. Oh, we found a generator. That should come in useful. There's a spot on the map that looks like it's a, a building, so I'm gonna go check that out. Oh yeah. Run from the wolves, run from the wolves, cause they're hungry like a wolf. Every time, every time, dude, fuck. <sighs> and then there's, okay requires generator so just a little draggy droppy I think and that should do yeah yeah <laughs> so friends this has been the demo of the wild eight I do hope that you have enjoyed that you will check it out on Kickstarter if it looks like something that you would enjoy I'm a sucker for the long dark so this thing pulled me in basically immediately um, I do hope that you'll join us for the next time, friends. I have been Brendan Dayton, your humble narrator. Don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy. And, uh, if you do, I will send you a $20 Ikea gift card. You're gonna really enjoy that. You can buy, uh, probably a lamp or some dishware, but you'll probably still have to assemble both of those yourself. <laughs> so, I hope to see you in the next one, friends. And until then, bye bye One? Two, three, four, goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.